Netflix's second original African series, Blood and Water, has been renewed for a second season. According to a statement released by Netflix on Monday, the second season will see Pulenga and Fikile deal with the consequences of their explosive confrontation as more mystery and drama unfolds. Showrunner and um, director um, Nof Nocifo Dumesa promises that Parkhurst is about to get really messy in the new season. I'm excited. I am excited. But it's going to take a I while because they're, they're, they're just starting shooting. Yeah. Right? I don't think they've started They've not shooting. even started. I think, I think they, they just announced to the cast. The renewal, members. yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. That's a long but I want to away. believe that there, there, there is definitely a continuity already. There is mm. a story somewhere. So mm. I can't wait. I was reading really some reactions that people were like that. They are surprised that they are excited that there is a <clears throat> season two. Mm. Because where it the story stopped right? yeah. in season one, they expected that there will be a season two. Season no, but, no, but there has been... Series like that, and then yeah. they just yeah, cut off. I think there's yeah. something that you have to do. Either you have a lot of viewing, mm -hmm. or um, you know, there's like, I think it's a measure you have to reach um, to see whether or not you would be able to you do a renewed. second. So I think that you have to plan like you are going mm -hmm. to win, but it's not all the time that so you, you get so it. So most of them, they don't just like plan the series in such a way that it ends. Yeah, at yeah, exactly. One. They are hoping yeah. that they mm -hmm. will get renewed. Yeah, because some people, yeah. some people have one um, one season, yes. like. Um, they'll be able to do one season and then tell me we'll have three seasons, six seasons and not I'm able to do I'm trying to remember. More. Okay, Crazy Lovely Cool that we had the cast. I mean, it's just right. one season. We've not seen season two. Even though it's mm. not a Netflix original, original. but I mean, it was really cool and Maybe you would expect, stuff. but where it ended as well was okay to end. Yeah. So, yeah. And then about Netflix originals, I'm excited about Nigeria's, you know, series um, Muabudu mm. with um, Baba Segi's wife mm -hmm. and um, the horseman, yeah. um, the one with Leshenka. I'm hoping that they'll be able to deliver like proper. proper production I, I'm to match so. with, I so with South Africa. But before yeah. that, there was a there was one that was supposed to um, that they were working on. Yeah, there was I one that they, was the work, name now. that they were working on. I know that so one like was in those Netflix 14. I know yeah, that yeah, was one they were working yeah, on. Yeah. That was supposed to be the first. Yeah, so. so we don't know where... But nobody that has one. said anything about that They're working. Production. They're not yes. making noise. Right. Let's keep our fingers crossed. Hmm. But yeah, we have a lot to um, to think about and to start mm. working on with this Netflix thing because it really changes the dynamics mm -hmm. of the competition. Yeah. I think for the longest time, before Netflix, we're using our numbers that we're the most watched, we're the, the most... Well. On yeah. Netflix, I think South Africa is a strong competition. Like, the, the quality of their movies, the, movies, the acting, the storylines. Have you seen the scary movie that they're bringing out on Netflix? Like, mm -hmm. When are we ever going to get to a level where our, uh, like our thrillers look like that? Like the side effects, the makeup and everything. Mm. Not thunder flashing and there's like one guy in a uniform. No, <laughs> like graphics. proper graphics. Like it felt like you're watching an American th um, tr thriller. So I think we're doing really well with the production quality. I think the movies that came out last year, even in cinema, was like crisp and clean, the audio mm -hmm. and everything. But I think we can do better with like really strong acting, really strong storyline, story yeah. yeah. But then the thing is, one thing that people always, you know, like comment about Nollywood is that we keep on seeing the same faces. And some of those faces have been accused of not being able to deliver right. when it comes to acting. So, because um, I remember that Mo Abode tweeted something that what does, what do Nigerians want her to do with the new um, series that she wants to do? And people were like, that cast new faces. Mm. Like we want to see new people on the screen because when you even look at some of the um people that debut from the netflix series most of them were not really known yeah in their yeah, country right. so it gave them like a huge exposure for their talent and all that so i hope that with nigeria or oh, mm. we would I the, my the nigeria effects will not affect hmm. the netflix series <laughs> yeah you're right man. That's not <laughs> the concern, but i'm waiting for blood and water at least mm -hmm. they've done well let them continue doing me well yeah. while we yeah. hope that other people will catch up but i can't wait for the first netflix original from nigeria i really can't yeah, wait i don't no, know if it's no, going no, to be more abudu no, first no. i don't know why the name of this ace director is not coming to mind but he's the one working on the first one so is it -Band, did it? no mm. um he's on the same level with kunla Fulayan and co so mm -hmm. i don't know